Hi again everyone. In tonight's video I thought I'd show a preliminary before I've done any of the machining. This is the machining of the throttle casting for the Allen Mogul and as you can see this is print 35 of the Allen Mogul set and I'm machining the casting there's not a lot to it. Um, first thing what I'm going to do tonight I've, I bought this brass union. This is the dry pipe that will go out um, carrying the steam out the front of the boiler. So I've got that here. I bought a quarter inch brass union today, the conventional union. I need to modify this, this union a little bit and silver solder it to a plug that I'll have to um, turn and drill through and and uh, tap the outside of the out, or thread the outside of the the plug and then drill and tap in here for the uh, the assembly to go to be threaded in to this. So I'll make this tonight so I can silver solder tomorrow and while I'm at it there's a top plug that gets made out of three quarter inch hexagonal brass as well. So that's also threaded 9 16 18 and I've got the had to go to my favorite hardware store and all they had was a hex tap, so I'll have to figure out how to make that work with my um, my tailstock die holder. I've got an idea about that. And happily, they also had a 9-16-18 tap for me. So I got all that stuff today. It's D&W hardware here. Um, the rest of it and following on later will be the actual valve that rocks back and forth and the stainless steel. I've got the stainless pieces for that and so I'll be posting updates on making the throttle here's a nice sketch of the actual plans you can see how the thing works and I did Marty Knox built my boiler he advised me to use time saver compound to smooth this face right here where the stainless steel button goes back and forth across this part of the throttle I'll have to mill this just slightly and then polish it with the uh, time saver compound. The time saver compound is a compound that um, the compound just um, diminishes into the metal and basically goes away, it becomes inactive as you use it. Other types of compound like the clover type that you use on automotive valves would not be appropriate because it continues to wear. So that's why you use the time saver on live steam products projects, excuse me. Okay, that's it for now, and I will post updates as we go. Thanks.